Hey, what up guys? How you doing? It is Lasty here. Welcome today to a new episode of the FIFA 19 Ultimate Team Road to Glory, episode number 254. And in today's episode, we are going to be working towards, well, not using this squad. Uh, we're going to be basically building something new uh, to comply with the requirements of one of the weekly objectives so that we can unlock a 90 rated TOTS for essentially free or for time you know um which has been the case every every week for the last few weeks so we start things off just by picking up my squad battles rewards um i'm actually yet to complete the one for the other tots player eggestein or something so i've still got that to do i need to do that before friday uh, to get myself a free 87 or 88 rated tots but today we are going to be going for that 90 rated brahimi uh, not to use or anything like that i don't think he looks super usable but he is 90 rated fodder, and that's exactly what we want. Now, if you guys do enjoy today's episode, do me a massive favor. Hit that thumbs up button. I want to see 1,436 likes. If you can make that happen, that would be an absolutely awesome achievement. Thank you so much in advance. Smash that thumbs up button. Um, didn't really get anything major from my squad battles rewards. I mean, we get an 83, and I'll take that. Uh, but I don't think it's like insane uh it's nothing crazy is it so we, we'll just stick the rest of the stuff in the club and uh stick the duplicates on the trade pile so that right there was a little glimpse of the squad i wanted to buy so i didn't want to do this just using the the players in my club because i didn't really have a full club of league and nos players i've sold a lot of stuff out of uh, of the road to glory uh, lately so i didn't have a full squad so i was like you know what i got a couple hundred k here i might as well go out and buy some of these tots players so, so that I can maybe enjoy myself, try out a few different players. It's that time of year, right? Team of the season. Uh, and considering I've kind of nearly got like my end game team, I would imagine, uh, these are the chances where it gives me an opportunity to use someone different. Now, I didn't have millions to spend, so I couldn't go out and buy that crazy Edo Militao or Alex Tellez. Uh, but this is the squad that we put together. And yes, there are three players there that are just absolutely not going to get played. Um, you know what the deal is with the online singles ones. They don't put that many strict requirements requirements on it which means everyone brings on three subs so my three subs are going to be Ronaldinho, Ibrahimovic and Tots Mane and that's how the team's going to line up in game really interested to uh, one try out that Seferovic up top and two try out Tots Pizzi as a CDM because he kind of has got pretty good stats so we needed to win Seven online singles matches using our Liga NOS 11 uh, and then three substitutes, which is very common. Literally everyone's bringing on their subs and stuff. This first guy's got Bruno Fernandes and he's also got Rafa out on the wide. Two very good ones to get. I would imagine one of them he would have got in a guaranteed Liga NOS pack and then who knows, maybe he packed one or bought one, who knows. Um, but I go 1-0 down to him. After I successfully block his tackle or block his shot with a tackle, he just gets the rebound and it goes back in. So one 1-0 down at halftime, not looking great for me. Uh, you all know my rules by now. It is uh, basically, if I go two goals down, I'll quit. Uh, the whole golden goal thing might be a little bit quicker, but a lot of people don't really stick to it if they're on the other side of it. And to be honest, one goal could literally come from kickoff, and that's not really the, the real result of a game. So um, I, I like to make it two goals, as you guys know. So I gracefully quit for my opponent when he uh, gets his second goal and goes 2-0 up against me. Moving on to the next one then. This looks like a pretty beatable team in my opinion. Uh, he brought a couple of subs on like Shevchenko and, and stuff like that. And he actually manages to score a front post volley with him. I can't believe my defender didn't get there. Uh, but then you won't be surprised to see the... Uh, the, the game just sort of stutters out and freezes, and that obviously means that someone's going to be doing the old uh, disconnection glitch, which I absolutely hate. So the first two games have gone legitimate loss, because I quit, and then one which is just a cheating loss, which uh, is annoying. So we'll move on to the next one, but I was like, oh man, is this challenge going to be like super difficult or something? Um, so we're going to the next game. Full gold league and our squad, as always, with a 90 Seferovic. It seemed like so many people had this player. Uh, I don't know whether he was just giving out loads in the guaranteed pack, or because he's one of the cheaper tots, people on it don't mind spending like 50k towards uh, one of the Liga NOS players to help them on their journey. Uh, but I came up against him an awful lot of times. So we actually go 1-0 up against this guy with a uh, first-time shot from Ronaldinho. And then Ibra goes in at the near post from the corner to make me 
nil up in eight minutes and uh, I'm not surprised that my opponent decides to quit out of that one at that point in time I would have done the exact same thing so at least we're on the board we've got one of our one of our seven victories now and we go into the next match again similar story I could have possibly used my 84 rated Zhao Felix if I didn't submit him recently into getting I don't know. Who did I get? Was it into Firmino? Maybe it was into Bobby's SBC. I'm not sure. Uh, and I'm still deliberating the whole, uh, do I get Goretzka? Uh, because that's, ah, uh, man. It just, the price almost keeps coming down every single day. And I'm very, very tempted by that card. Uh, and like I said to you yesterday, I think I'll probably base that off of um, whether or not I get someone like Da Costa or Havertz, luckily, in my gold three rewards this week. If it happens and I get a really good German that I can definitely use in my final squad, then I would, uh, it would, it would have to be the right one. It would basically have to be like Da Costa or Havertz or Royce, um, and that, that would make me cho uh, change my mind and, and complete, try and complete the, uh, the Tots Goretzka anyway. Like, we don't necessarily have the coins for it, uh, but we could outlay Mane. It, like, if there was a German thing coming into the squad maybe Mane it would be time for him to leave so that we could like put the left hand side of our squad as the the Liverpool and the Prem stuff with Ronaldinho in it and then the right hand side could be like Da Costa, Goretzka and then someone else out on the right wing I don't know how it would work but uh yeah we might be able to graft and grind towards getting that Goretzka just simply because um in the 87 rated squad which is like a third or a half of the price of the whole SBC. Uh, it means that we could like stick in like a 93 Tots out of Iroud that I'm never going to use. Uh, the 90 Brahimi that we're going to get from today's video and stuff. Like free Tots players like that, that they could be what actually pay for uh, the Goretzka. So we'll see if I can make that happen later on in the week, all dependent on. Like I'm not going to go out and do a 500, 600k SBC if I don't have anyone to link him with and then I'm going to end up with no coins. It just doesn't make sense. Uh, but if there's a chance that I, I can make it a part of my team, then yeah, we'll do that. Uh, and uh, that will be in a couple of days' time. So we get another another victory here. This one went to 3-0, uh, which is fine. It only took 33 minutes, so it's just not the end of the world. Uh, and we go into the next one. The next most common player I think I would come up against is this 94, Bruno Fernandes. Uh, I feel very jealous of anyone that was able to pack him in their, in their guaranteed tots pack because he does look like a complete gem. He's got insanely good stats. Like He looks like a great little player. Uh, and he's a lot less like he looks very similar to Bernardo Silva but um, he's obviously in a slightly lesser league and stuff so he's a lot lot cheaper uh, than his fellow Portuguese teammate now I get an equalizer this was a tough old game so we both brought on our three OP subs his was player of the month Rashford uh, Mbappe 89 and I'm not sure who else there was one more crazy player that he brought on and it was it was 2-1 to him at half time so it was a tough old game 50 50 possession we were both on constant pressure that's one thing I didn't show you is that I actually decided to put constant pressure on to see if it would work or if we'd be losing out typically these games are obviously played out in the first half um it's it's not often that these games go the distance <coughs> because typically someone quits at some point in time so i figured constant pressure could help me just win that ball back time and time again get up there throw loads into the attack get my wins nice and quickly and stuff but no this one just tired my players out and we went all the way to penalties uh which is just a lottery at that point right so i save his first one which is good uh, and i think i end up scoring my first one here with ronaldinho baiting him one way and ended up going the other way so it's one nil an advantage to last the right now rashford steps up i dive the right way but what a perfect penalty in off the post there's no saving that one and then i'm pretty sure i get saved so yeah actually we even out at this point in time it is just one apiece he then steps up with mbappe and makes it super obvious where he's going and doesn't bait me out and switch it at the last minute so uh actually uh, I, I was able to save it and then score my next one so i am currently in the lead he then steps up goes the same way again and makes it look super obvious so i just saved the penalty again However, I step up, go that way, score the goal, win the game, and that was that. So it went 120 minutes and into penalties for me to finally win. But GG's to that guy. That was a very intense game. That was more like a foot champs game. Uh, and as much as I, I, you know, as much as scoring a header and, and, and winning a game because he quits after six minutes is, is good for my, like, getting the, the challenge done, 
uh, going 120 minutes and going into penalties. That's that was kind of fun. It was it was like a challenge, you know. Um, and I I don't know how I would feel if I came out of the penalty shootout as the loser. I guess I'd feel totally different about that. But it was a a good game and a, and a good test against a uh, very similarly leveled player. So I'm not sure how many we've got at this point in time. We might only need like one or two more. Um, and I picked the ball up with Danilo Pereira, who was great, by the way. I really liked him as a CDM. And I think that shot with Seferovic was actually going wide. Uh, and it ended up getting saved by the goalkeeper and almost pushed into his goal, which is uh, unlucky for my opponent. But I was fully dominating this game, trying to have fun, trying to, you know, score some different goals that isn't isn't just me crossing it into the box and heading it uh, and that one was just goes to show you just how crazy op la croquetta can be one way then the other way then the other way and then they, they just can't defend it it's absolutely nuts um and i think we've got six out of seven at this point so it is time to go into this final game here uh, and when you see a squad like this <coughs> with one blue and you think okay well it's not the greatest of blues he probably got that in his guaranteed pack and the rest of the squad doesn't look that amazing either i'm like pretty confident as i go into it that i'll, I'll come away with the win um so i go one nil up with Mane right there i just pick the ball up take a touch and then bang it far post solid strike and uh, that is the one nil for us Mane then whips it into seferovic back to ibra into ronaldinho uh, and you can see it's a bit of a stuttery laggy game you get that in the peer-to-peer -peer online single matches from time to time um but he pauses it and that is going to be him gone after 2-0 in that one which means we are going to unlock ourselves a 90 rated tots essentially for free uh it took about an hour and a half i think which is a little bit longer than some of the times that i've done it before but of course we did have a couple of those games where uh or one of those games in particular which went all the way to penalties which obviously takes up about half an hour of your time if you do all of that so 90 rated brahimi I don't think looks that that usable. Uh, he's got great dribbling and stuff, but uh, for some reason I had it in my head that he was a five-star skiller. I guess not. Uh, so this was the team that we completed it with, and I can now go ahead and sell off those players, which um, I make money on Pizzy. And I sell everyone for pretty much the same, if not a little bit more than what I bought them for. So I think we're going to end up coming away like profitable here today uh not on seferovic we'll lose a little bit on tax for him uh pizzy though had gone up and i actually made like well you know i got 10k out of him so i made a few k after tax probably just about broke even there with felipe uh, and then well who else did we have uh, all the golds i listed them up but i added like chemistry styles and position changes so um I was able to sell them for a bit more than what I actually bought them for, uh, which you can add on to my profit or you can take away from the profit because I had to use chemistry styles and position changes to get them there. But that is basically going to wrap things up for today's video, guys. We've managed to get ourselves a 90 rated tots from the objectives. I'm not going to actually go towards the Belgian one in rivals because I don't I don't like that challenge. Um, so I won't participate in that. But we've got one of them that's 90 rated. I'll do the squad battles one, probably just off camera or something, so that I can get that uh, 88 rated Eggestein. And that is going to wrap things up for today. This is the main squad, as you know it. We've got Mane and we've got Ronaldinho, we've got Firmino, basically Tots, Liverpool, and Premier League. Uh, and uh, it looks like a nice squad. However, I did bottle the weekend league with it. Let me know what you think of the content this week with Bundesliga and Liga Nos. I'd be very interested in that. Smash a thumbs up, subscribe if you're new, follow me on Twitter, follow me on Insta. Those links are down below. Most importantly, I hope you all have a lovely day and I'll catch you next time. Peace.